everybody. Wanted to invite you into my studio this afternoon so you can kind of check out what I'm working on. What you see right here is a concept sketch that I've started putting together. This is an idea I had about the first book that I remember my mom reading to me when I was little. Some of you will recognize these critters here from where the wild things are. And this story is really dear to me for a lot of reasons. And I wanted to do a book page about Max and his adventures. So what you're looking at here is a concept sketch. I started kind of putting together the idea of what I wanted this piece to be about. So you can see this is towards the this is towards the end of the story where Max has had his adventures and he's leaving in his sailing ship and one of the monsters, wild things that he spent time with is going to be silhouetted watching him leave these trees and palm trees and island plant life will all be silhouetted and then we'll have a real pretty moon and starry sky as Max sails away. So this is kind of the rough I was figuring out what it is that I wanted in the picture. Um, you can see here, I kind of worked through how this Wild Things tail is composed. And it was kind of looking like a cat tail. But then I went back to my reference material. And you can see here, he's actually caught quite a bushy, fluffy, almost fox type tail. Really close to Max's actually in his outfit. I kind of like the idea of the tail spilling out over the oval that is going to contain the picture. I kind of wanted the tail to droop a little, kind of convey that there's some sadness seeing his buddy sail away. So the next step, after I've got the basic concept down, is to refine that concept and that sketch. So this is the next phase and I moved the moon down a little bit from where it was in the original concept sketch and I actually made Max and his boat a little bit smaller and farther away in the distance. And I, I'm, I'm liking how this is looking and I think I'm ready to put it on the page. Uh, real excited about the page that I found. I found a vintage, I actually found this book quite a while ago and didn't realize that this is what I'd be painting on it. But when I was looking for a book that would be appropriate for where the wild things are, I came across this book I'd picked up maybe, I don't know, two years ago, uh, The Field Guide to Wildlife Habitats. And I just think this is gonna be great. And I love that the five-lined skink is gonna be on this page. I think some of the wild things that Max encountered could almost be called a skink. I actually don't know what a skink is, but I think it's a great monster name, so. I'm just now ready to re-sketch this concept onto the book page and then I'll start adding some watercolor. I'm real excited about this one. So stay tuned. I'll give you updates. Bye everybody.